welcome, Barton Trail. And let's be frank. We've got yet another problem on campus. The stairwells. Specifically, the conditions of the stairwells. It's not just the gum on the ground, as students can obviously not chew gum and walk upstairs at the same time. It's not just the ooze on the stairwells as you go up early in the morning. It's the post-lunch stairwell. The trash, specifically, the ketchup. Barbecue sauce, mustard every once in a while, but the ketchup. You know, the container that comes with your fries and your chicken nuggets. The ketchup is way, way too much. We talked to some people on campus about this, this ketchup problem, this huge problem. Here's what they had to say. Coach Peaver, what do you have to say about this huge problem? It's a huge problem. We're using too much ketchup, Bartram Trail. It's as simple as, it's as simple as supply and demand. Okay, folks, we are having a ketchup shortage on campus. If you go into the cafeteria and talk to some of the cafeteria workers, they'll confirm this. We're wasting ketchup. There are people dying in the world, yet at Barton Trail, we don't care. We eat as much ketchup as we want and take more than we need. You know what I'm talking about. You've probably stepped in it. There's a big problem now. We need to be able to handle this. Folks, it's not that hard. When you go to a little ketchup squirter, take out a little bit less. Don't use it all. You don't need all that ketchup. Come on. Your mom says your eyes are bigger than your mouth. This is true. Folks, whether you call it ketchup or catsup, I like the hoi polloi of America, please, don't use so much. And if you're going to use it, don't leave it in the stairwell. We're stepping in it. And of course, that's never sanitary. Barsham Trail, do what you can. Clean up the ketchup problem. <laughs> And now, Todd, back to you. No, 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 don't, don't worry about it. I'm okay. All right, if you insist. Well, there's another problem, specifically with the media and subliminal advertising. It's inappropriate. It's not fair. It's unethical. There is a track meeting on Wednesday, 8.15 in the morning, small cafeteria. If you think you're fast, be there. Thanks, Todd. Back to you.